Welcome to VW Life. We are here today and sitting and are standing in front of the 63 Beetle. We're yeah. going to be working on it today. We're going to pull the wheels, uh, try to start it and pull the motor and start getting this thing back on the road. Yes. So we picked this thing up. You've seen the video. We rescued the thing that had been sitting in storage for 20 years. And today we're going to see, uh, we're going to, we're going to do basically a road duration on this thing. And it is so dry and just a really clean little beetle. So we're excited to bring you guys along and let's see what happens. Let's cool. get started. Cool. All right. All right, are we gonna see if it starts? It smells good in here. It smells like an old meal. I like that call. Oh, it needs power. It's just dead, dead in the door now. You didn't have any power. Oh, All right, we got it hooked up to the charger. Let's see if it starts. Oh, no. you, oh that's not starting. That's uh, it's stuck. All right, well, it didn't start. We think we have a starter issue. The solenoid's stuck. So we're gonna get it into the shop. Clean her up, take yeah, off the wheels. We're gonna paint the wheels today. This thing's, this thing's good. This thing's and we're gonna pull that like motor. Like a, this car smells. It like smells like old Volkswagen. Yeah, it smells like a Beetle. Hey, you wanna get that side? I just don't want this thing falling off. Yeah. <laughs> All right, yeah, now I'm good. Now it works. Whoa, all the way. All right, now we're just pulling it. Yeah. Dang it. That's how you don't have to. Whatever. Four things. All right. Front drum isn't coming off. Yeah, and something we picked up recently at the Kenny Hill shop is a uh, puller. Yeah, so we get to use it today. We'll see if it works. Cool. For me. <laughs> oh yeah, you can have that too. Yeah, you can have that. Now it comes. It's moving. Is it? Yeah. It's gonna pop. It's gonna pop off. Dude, feel that tension. Tension on that. Holy crap. Well, you're dragging the brakes with it. Yeah, it's pulling the whole thing out. That's awesome. Keep going. You know, here, you do it something. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That's why it's got to get that dip blow on it. Here it oh, comes. It's coming. Yeah, it's just going to slide off. There it went. There it goes. It's not, well, yeah, but that's because the brake pads there it went. are holding it. Yeah, look at that. The brake pads are stuck and all crooked now. And if I just pulled them out. That's all right. Holy shnikes. Oh, yeah. They're like totally just pulled them off because they were frozen. This is why this thing wouldn't turn. Yeah. Yeah. Look. Show us what. Why? Oh. Broke the spring. Look. Off. You can see where it was frozen right there. Let's replace them. Still has the rollers on it. it have never been changed. Yeah. Roller bearings. Yeah. Uh huh. Yeah. Look at that. Martin, press on the brake slowly. Oh, it doesn't do nothing. Uh, oh, oh yeah. Oh, we got some movement. We got fluid back here. That's fine. Don't worry about it. That's all I wanted to see. Wow, is this barely They're all so stuck. 20 years of sitting. Yeah, we're gonna need the puller. Good thing we had it. I got it. Well, we got the brakes apart and now it's time to accomplish lunch. Yeah, oh, we're good at that. Guess where we're going. What? DW Live, Potter Barrier means lunch. Alright, now we gotta get paint for the 
we accomplished lunch and we picked up we picked up some paint and we're gonna do a two-tone, right? Mm -hmm. So the inner ring is gonna be this the inner ring will be this green color and then the outer ring will be this green color. So we're gonna sand them up, tape them up, paint them up. Look at that. All right, cool. So we lucked out on the brakes, but yeah. we went to Tommy's and picked up some uh, hardware. And uh, so they'll be working on the brake situation while we're doing wheels. All right, well, let's start. Fine. Gary's gonna ground the solenoid on the starter. Starter's dead, isn't it? Might need a new starter. Maybe. It's kicking. Is that motor stuck? Hot up. I'm sorry. No. No. Try it again. That sounds like it, the battery don't do it. Right. No. I'm gonna try to turn it over. What are you gonna turn it up to, Martin? Oh, shiza, I heard that. Okay. Fire the hole. Here we go. Woo! We have a dead battery. Yeah. That's a lot of amperage going through it. Yeah, it's just, it's not, it's just kicking that solenoid out. It's not even doing that. No, it's not. Eh, eh. Okay, we got our cream paint all shooken up. We're gonna do them all in cream and then we'll come back and tape off and the center will be green. And we didn't tape off two of them because those two are getting new tires. We should have ordered everything ahead of time. It, lesson learned. We knew we were going to do this, and we should have like just went ahead and just psh, ordered stem to stern, but we didn't. But that's okay. So uh, I'm going to pick up the wheel cylinders tomorrow. So we can put the drums and everything on. It just won't have any brake guts on the front, so we can roll it in and out. But we do have enough to do the rears. Yes. So now that the uh, the wheels are painted, we're going to finish out the rear brakes. We have everything to do the rear brakes, so we'll get those on. The wheels are halfway done. We've painted the cream color. We're gonna let them dry before we try taping off the outside edge to paint the uh, green on the inside. They're done for today. Silver paste, coming right at you. Everybody needs a little silver paste in their life. This one's not sponsored by whatever this brand is, but it is sponsored by Silver Paste. Asked for by name. Pads and then the drums, and we'll be moving along on this story. <laughs> we want to get these little guys. Adjusted all the way in, right? All the way in. Yeah, they got Silver Paste on them. And then you want them perpendicular. Just like that. Grease it up and we go back at it. All right, we got the front back on there. There are no brake parts in there, but the wheels are going back hey, on. Hey, 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 Stops on. like a Baja. Yeah, hey, that's sideways. Hang this on one's on there too. No brake parts. Making progress. Coming down. We got a list, and we got one thing not mark, marked oh off. Oh my god! We marked something off the list. Yep, that's pretty good. But we have about a twenty other things. It's not that bad though. Do you have paint grills? Yeah, paint. Yeah, I have that on there. Re reseal and or do, I mean, we gotta take apart the motor and. That's not even on here. No, it's not. Uh, Blast ten. Oh, I got sandblast tens right here, Jake. Jake's got to do that yeah. and get the tires is mounted. He, is that on here? No. 
What else we say? Oh, resale motor. All right, everybody. Uh, thank you for joining us today. Our first work day on the '63 boys. Yep. Yeah. I think we made some progress. We did. Yeah. I don't it, think we accomplished as much as when we did the Playmobil assembly, but <laughs> yeah. we, we did pretty decent. Yeah, we did. Yeah, we, we knocked that out in ballpark. Yeah, this was, one, eh. We had all the parts for that. I, I think that's a lesson for everybody. When you dive in, you don't know what you're going to get into until you get in there. We didn't know what kind of situation the brakes were in this until we pulled them off. We started going, uh-oh. We're kind of hoping it would be all good to go, but yeah. it wasn't. So we yeah. got to order brakes and several other things. Yeah, because rumor has it, it had a new brake job at some point while it was sitting in storage. Thank you guys very much for joining us today. Make sure you tell your aunts, tell your uncles, tell everybody you know about VW Life. We do this for you guys, the VW Life community, because, well, this is what it's all about. Uh, go outside, find you a Volkswagen start working on. Stay with us. Uh, the 63 build will continue and it's going to be a really nice little car when it's done. So thank you guys.